Welcome to the AR Taxonomy Editor Overview. We begin by connecting up to the taxonomy server. We can see that there's a list of taxonomies that are on the server. Right now there's only one. So let's create a new one from scratch. So we simply add the name, we'll call it Stuff, and create the taxonomy. It's as simple as that. So we could edit this taxonomy, but let's go ahead and edit the science and technology taxonomy instead. So here we are on the Edit Taxonomy page. On the left we have the Taxonomy Management pane. This is where you will create new nodes, delete nodes, rename nodes, and do all the things you would expect to do in a modern user interface. So let's click on Robotics. On the right we have the Taxonomy Node Properties pane. This contains three fields, the term name, notes, and a classification rule. In this case, the classification rule is robotics, just the word. The classification rule is the heart of AR taxonomy. Now we can test this rule. So simply hit the button test and we get back the search results. So you see we have 257 documents returned. We can click on the documents and get a preview of the document down below. In this case we are just displaying the patent title and abstract. You can also click on the properties tab to see some of the metadata properties of this document. So we can view and test the rule and preview the results. Now what if we don't think that carbohydrates belong with robotics? Let's create an exclusion rule. Now there's 257 items. Test. Now there's 256. So we've gotten rid of that rogue carbohydrates document. So once you have what you want you can publish the taxonomies. So we can go back to the Manage Taxonomy page, we can click the Publish button, and that will go out and apply the taxonomy to all the documents in the index. Once we've published our taxonomies, let's go test them in a search interface. We've set up MarkLogic to have a facet index called simply Taxonomy. So why don't we type in tubes? Let's look at carbon nanotubes. Now we have 10 hits, that mention nanotubes and tubes. So we can very quickly drill down to exactly the information we're looking for using a combination of facets to find exactly what documents are where. That's a quick tour of AR Taxonomy Editor. There's a lot more to it, of course, but those are the basics. You can see how easy it is to build and maintain enterprise categorization taxonomies on the MarkLogic platform. Thanks for watching. Please visit AppliedRelevance.com for more information about AR Taxonomy Editor, MarkLogic, and our unique Agile approach to taxonomies.